Hey guys and welcome to the video and I hope that you are feeling awesome. Alright, I'm just dropping off Yvonne to work. Well there she goes, off to work there guys. Oh bless her, I hope she has a great day at work today. Now that she's on her way into work, that means I'm going to be taking you guys into town because we got to get rid of that huge bag of goodies there to give to the local charity uh, Salvation Army. i got to be honest guys, the uh, weather today seems to be all over the place because I was going to do a time lapse video today and I looked out and I thought, oh, getting a bit of blue, blue sky over there. And then I was like, wait a second, we got some really dark clouds coming so I thought, you know what, I'm not going to take the chance. Well, regardless of the weather, guys, you've got to get on and get things done. And to be truthful, honest, me and Yvonne's been talking about a few designs for the garden, right? And I am so looking forward to uh, getting those done. And also, what I'm going to look forward to doing is something like maybe a John's Extra video uh, showing you the progress of the uh, stages of doing all the DIY stuff. Now, that's that huge bag of stuff given to charity. And i got to admit, me and Yvonne has been speaking about how much stuff we've given to charity and it's absolutely amazing the amount of bags that we have given and to be truthfully honest it's a nice thing to do is uh, give your unwanted stuff to charity and maybe somebody might make a good gift of it to somebody else or it might be something that somebody really really needs so it's always good to give you know a little bit away however I really want to show you this area guys because it's so beautiful that what we're looking at guys is the uh, Risen Brook there and the Risen Brook actually comes from Hensford which flows through Rugeley which then dissipates into the uh, River Trent but one thing I've got to get done today is my social media clip because I have been so busy this morning I haven't had the chance to do it so I'm thinking I've found the perfect little place here to get on with my social media clip and then once I've done that I'm going to get myself home, get editing and pretty much get ready to get back to work. I've got to confess guys this morning I am all out of sync basically i had a crappy night's sleep last night i woke up late this morning and i feel like my life is especially today all out of sync what can you do i suppose you just got to get up there get perseverance and you know just get on with it but i will say one thing the sky today is looking really really nice just look at that Ooh, that's fantastic wow guys it is starting to really hammer down now i must admit I thought, is it going to rain? Maybe it might rain, maybe it's not, not going to rain. But then I just sat in the car and then it just suddenly started raining. And I'm like, well, that was good timing. However, I'm hoping that once I get out there, I'm not going to get that wet. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to enjoy the rest of my break and uh, make a phone call to Yvonne. And hopefully this weather has calmed down by the time uh, my break's finished. Wow, guys. What a cracking day I've had. I am absolutely freaking dead to the world here guys I have just done pretty much a 10 hour shift there guys and uh, I don't know why I just seem to be able to do them and but anyway I'm gonna get on home now and uh, meet Yvonne and then chill with Yvonne for a bit but we've just started having rain guys and it's like bomb because I wanted to put my phone outside to do a time-lapse video because that sky over there looks absolutely so freaking beautiful I swear to god it does however I'm going to have to get back in because it's actually starting to pee down a bit much in here, right? Wow, that was so cool to capture that on camera. However, guys, it's absolutely strange. I'm seeing daylight. Today, um, I'm doing a shift swap with a colleague of mine, and it means that me and Yvonne get to start at the same time. And I must admit, I'm quite looking forward to... Uh, getting home later because I've started making a blooper reel guys and I have been in fits of laughter this morning and I can't wait for you guys just to you know I don't know have a free laugh on me right guys it's that time now me and Yvonne are now off to work there she is just over there say hi guys hi guys <laughs> but yeah it's, it's one of those strange things as I was saying earlier that um I'm not used to uh, seeing light in the morning so this is a a, a nice treat in a sense because at least I get to see where I'm walking but anyway we do have to get to work oh, guys I feel really really positive today because it's been 
over a month now I've been on my new department and I've got to confess I have got so fast at working all like all the bread cakes and stuff like that and I was just speaking to Yvonne about it because she's just had a break with me and she's gone in now but um, I was saying to her about it and she says well you do need to slow down a bit John I went yeah but the thing is I'm so used to being fast so it's kind of weird when you've been used to a certain thing of like doing things a certain way and then you just change you know course in, in your life and then you choose something you do something different but anyway guys i tell you it's now the weather today it's been all over the place and these clouds here are really looking like intriguing Well guys, I hope you enjoyed that view of the uh, clouds and I must admit it was a brilliant view to have uh, my uh, break with. But anyways, I've got to get back in the store and uh, get on with the rest of my shift. Wow guys, now that was a shift and a half and I must admit I pushed myself to get more stock out on the shelf so uh, it helps my colleagues and not have to work so much uh, tomorrow. However, guys, I am absolutely beat. But anyways, I'm waiting for Yvonne and then we are going to head off home and uh, chill, I believe, for the rest of the evening because I am absolutely shattered, honestly, guys. So I really want to say thank you all for coming by. It means the world to me and thank you to every single one of you who has followed me, subscribed to me and, you know, likes all my content. It means the world. But anyway, I've got to go. I hope that you have a great day and always do your best, guys, to stay positive and screw all those negatives and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right. Bye-bye.